Hey guys, how's everything going? This is Jacer. Uh, in this video, let's talk about a reflect object. Um, I think before, um, in my channel, I've already covered uh, a proxy handler traps. Uh, it's very uh, interesting and very powerful for advanced technology, advanced uh, use cases. Though it's not uh, used in ordinary uh, web development. And in that, I think in that materials, we've already seen some examples of a reflect here, like. This is an example of selective proxy property ac accesses. So we want to create a proxy. When we access the proxy, not proxy, and then just to return the not proxy the original value. Uh, but if we use proxy, and we want to get some replaced value. So how we do that is get the set a get trap, and then if this is if it is a property what we want, we return something else. If not, we call this reflect get. Although we could just uh, call the target. Uh, props there as well. I think it doesn't make a maybe some difference, but maybe not. I don't think there is some ex uh, uh, difference here. But this is kind of like handy, right? You don't need to want to say uh, it's kind of like um, we are focusing on those uh, prototype uh, functions methods here, but we don't want to know anything about. Uh, the target, like the object itself or the arguments. We just say, okay, we want to trigger this uh, prototype method with some a bunch of arguments and uh, do whatever you need. So yeah, the reflex actually has all the, the methods are all the same as those in the proxy handlers. So if you already cover them, there are a lot of them, like function apply, uh, function the constructor, uh, define property, delete, get setter has for in extensible on keys plop plop so i think for the reflect they're the same because we have the apply is for for function apply and con construct different property delete property get get on property get prototype of a has extensible on keys um yeah they're basically the same um but though some of them, these methods are also in, uh, the same as corresponding methods on object prototype, although they do have some subtle difference. We'll cover the subtle, dif subtle difference here. But first, let's see uh, through all those dis descriptions here. Reflect apply, function apply would be nothing special. Uh, this is construct. Yeah, we could just use this to construct a, 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 a create a, a class instance. Um, but it's just the same as new, I would say. Equivalent to new. Uh huh. Similar to define property, returns a boolean. It is true if the property was successfully defined. Uh huh. But object for define property doesn't return anything, right? I would say return. Ret yeah. It says for the. It has different return value, actually. But ref reflect define property has better. Um, I think it's more powerful because we could know the result. The property same, I would say. It says equivalent. Maybe there is some uh, return value. Uh, it doesn't return anything. Returns boolean. Yeah, cool. Get return works like get a property. I think it's the same. Nothing special. Yeah. Blah 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 has extensible. Yeah, same as this. Returns an array of targets on not inherited on property keys. Does this have the uh, uh, symbol? I always forget forget by this. Got on properties contact symbols. Yeah, it has the proper uh, the symbols. Prevent extension said returns boolean. Yeah, this one is interest uh, very useful. Yeah, re reflect set it will return a, a boolean. Uh, of true, if it's accessible, we could know the result. So here's an example. A use case is detecting whether an object contains certain properties. Uh huh. You say has reflect has dot color. Yeah, this is for in right. This it, has oh, yeah, here is for in property operator. Yeah, it would say true. And if not, it has dot uh false. Return objects on key reflect on keys. This is different than object keys. Object keys doesn't have the uh, object t keys doesn't have the uh, symbol, right? Object um, 
keys. Innumerable stream properties, so it doesn't have the simples. Awesome. Uh, add a new property to the object. Yeah, reflect set duck eyes black. It's the same as duck set a uh, set duck, but we don't know the result, right? So yeah, returns a root true if successful. Awesome. Um, let's go to the difference, subtle difference be between these, um, these reflect and object methods. The prototype. Oh, this is not prototype. I'm sorry. It's object static object methods. Define property and object define property. Difference is yeah, it will return the object passed. Return type error if property is not successful. Uh huh. Reflect return true. False. Yeah, it's, so it just only returns the boolean. Define properties, the same, I would say. But for reflect lag, it doesn't return anything. Hmm, interesting. Return subjects, okay. Set. Um, hmm, set, what, what's... Oh, uh, this is not returning anything. It's just a reflect, doesn't have this... Uh, a function method. Yeah, I just say, mm, wh why, where, why there is a static method of object for set? There's not no such thing. Uh, yeah, here returns true, returns false, or throws and type error. Get, um, yeah, no such method. The same as set, I would say. Delete property returns true. Delete it. Yeah. Get on property descriptors returns a property description of a given property. If it existed, and it returns undefined, if it does not exist. If it's not an object, it will coerce into an object. Like, yeah, if it is number, it will go into a number object. Number wrap, wrapper object. Okay, if it returns a uh, property, for, if it is reflect, it will return the property, yeah. Returns undefined, so far it's not it's the same. But it will not do coercion, yeah, cool. Get on property descriptors not supported by uh, not supported by reflect. Get prototype of returns the prototype given the object returns now if there are no properties. Throws a type error is not it is, if it is not object but coerce a non object in uh, newest JavaScript. I think there is no coercion here, right? Yeah. Set prototype of returns the object itself if it's uh no, if it is prototype was set successful uh-huh there's a type error if the prototype being set wasn't anything other than object or no or if the prototype for objects being modified is non extensible wow there's so much things going on but for for reflect if it's the tr successfully set it returns true if it isn't through a type error uh a false if a target is not object through type error if it is put that being said, was anything other than objects or no? So the difference is that for object me static method, if it is non extensible, it will throw in type error. Well, reasonable. Uh, but for reflect, non extensible means a false. It means not error. Hmm, interesting. Subtle difference. Egg is extensible. Returns true, false if not, and then returns type error if an object, for, for, for new, you will be coerced. And a return false. Non extensible ordinary object and a return false. Huh. Returns true and a false, return type error. Hmm. Simple. So reflect is much more straightforward and no, no such. Uh, glitches. I, I, so those, yeah. So those coercion. I don't like those things. Prevent extensions. If through a type error, type error if an ob object, and if for newest JavaScript version, your trip says non extensible, and it re returns the object to itself. Yeah, treat as non extensible, but. For reflect, we just throw in types error. Yeah, I love to reflect better. Keys returns an array of the strings. Yes, no symbols. 
Uh, but for reflect, there's no keys, but it reflect has own keys. Returns an array of property names and make um, yeah, but they, they return different things. So they cannot just to be used to we don't have the same names. Awesome. Um, so that's for reflect. Uh, it's very useful. I would say I love it. Uh, it's very straightforward and uh, it has very good support for mo uh, modern browsers and uh, we, we are free and we are safe to use them. Cool. Uh, but I would say it's most useful for uh, the proxies, right? If you write some proxies and we want to um, we want to do the original behavior, then we could just re use reflect. So it's a, ve a very good companion for uh, the proxy. And uh, if you are interested in the proxy, I have another video for this. For, so for search, please search here on my channel. And I hope you help. See you next time. Bye-bye.